Report your ailments. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Get out of picture. Picture. the simple girl who caused his majesty so many sleepless nights. There's nothing simple about me. Then I'll see to it your torture and execution are as complex as possible. Risha, what are you doing here? Let her go, and you can do whatever you want with me. Unfortunately for your Togruta friend, I'm to leave no witnesses. Besides, this planet offers precious little else in the way of entertainment. Who's up for a dance? What are you lost? Chini Rift does that away. That man kidnapped me because of you, Risha. He was going to kill us both. Why? It doesn't matter. I'm sorry for what happened, but it's over. You're sorry? He held me prisoner for days, threatened to kill me, and you're sorry? Adila, when I heard the shooting, I thought... You thought wrong. Show her how happy you are to see her. I'm never letting you out of my sight again. I'm all right, Jiren. But I never want to see Risha again. 
We're done. I just risked my life for you. She wouldn't keep a secret without good reason, Adila. I promise I'll explain everything to you someday. Have I ever let you down? Risha told me you're like a sister to her. We've been through a lot. That's what made this so horrible. I need to get off this stinking planet. Get a bit of distance, think. Here, take these credits. They'll get you off Tatooine. Help. I'll want that explanation someday, Risha. I'll let you know where to find us. I hope so. Thanks for taking care of these scum, Captain. They seemed like they needed killing. We're done here. See you. We only have one delivery left to make, Captain. Set course for Nar Shada. I thought we'd finished our business on Nar Shada. I needed time to set up this deal. I'll explain when we get there. Have to give credit where it's due, Captain. You've done an amazing job delivering this cargo. I always knew you would. It's so hard to be humble, knowing how great I am. It's even harder for the rest of us. No one has ever come as close to finding Noctrain's riches as we are now. How will you spend all that reward when you finally get it? What will you do with your share? Ask me again when I have it. Your last job is taking the men and the Carbonite to these coordinates. It's a restricted area. Only us and the buyer will be there. That's right. I'll help you negotiate this deal personally. But don't worry. I'm sure you'll do most of the talking. All I care about is my fee. Your reward is the secret location of Noctrain's riches. No fooling. I'll run ahead and make sure everything's in place. Meet me there with our friend and the Carbonite. Use this access card to enter the restricted area. I'll see you at the delivery point.
identical pads are currently open for business. Have a safe and pleasant stay. This is a big moment, Captain. Bigger than you probably realized. I've waited ten years for it. Is the fish head our buyer? Not exactly. He's here to oversee the delivery. Dr. Chela. Let's introduce the captain to the man in carbonite. Begin the procedure. How long has it been? Ten years. I'm sorry it took so long, but I finally have everything you told me to find. Come closer, Lishan. Let me see you. I'm different now. Not that little girl constantly underfoot. Now you are my heir, my legacy. Captain, meet my father, Nakdrayan. I believe I've mentioned him once or twice. Heard a lot about you, Nock. If you're not dead, were those other stories made up too? What does it matter if people believe them? Sorry I wasn't completely honest, Captain. I promised Father when he entered Dr. Chela's hibernation treatment I'd never tell anyone the truth. You're a good liar. I'll give you that. Trust is a vice for the weak. I learned that the hard way. Ten years ago, one of my lieutenants deliberately infected me with a disease. It's deadly, incurable, and eating me alive. You replace the infected parts with all that machinery, right? I've done everything to stop this disease, but it's never been enough. Soon, the illness will consume my vital organs.
Rumor is Jedi can heal anything. The Jedi proved uncooperative. I killed three trying to learn their secrets. But that is not our present concern. I lied about my father, Captain. But not his lost fortune. That's real. And thanks to all those starship upgrades, it's yours. You have the only starship in the galaxy equipped to travel where the fortune was lost. No one else can reach it. There is a region of space beyond the Outer Rim, called the Long Shadow. There are no stars, no light, no life. Just a derelict starship drifting into a massive black hole. My fortune waits for you there. I'm sorry. Did you say massive black hole? Few spacers have seen the long shadow and survived. They describe it as a vast darkness, slowly consuming the galaxy. I will give you the coordinates to the derelict vessel. You'll fly into the long shadow and board it. Retrieve the vessel's reliquary and bring it here. Risha will take a single item. The rest is yours. Tell me about this single item Risha gets. A simple piece of ornamentation. It has no value to you. My daughter will stay here. I have things to tell her. And my time grows short. Be careful out there. I've gotten used to seeing you. I'll always come back for you, Risha. The derelict vessel is at these coordinates. Go now. Warning, hull integrity failing. This vessel is entering the Singularity's event horizon. I'm thinking we should make this quick, Captain.
Let's find our treasure and get out of here. Vessel disintegration imminent. All crew advised to abandon ship. Better? Warning, hull integrity failing. This vessel is entering the Singularity's event horizon. Vessel disintegration imminent. All crew advised to abandon ship. Biological entities identified. Beginning mandatory royal edict playback. I, King Eric Drain the Third, find my throne under attack. Traitors aim to take what rightfully belongs to me. The wealth of Dubrillion will not fall into the hands of my enemies. Instead, I will remove it from their reach. My royal executioner droid will sabotage this vessel's hyperdrive and exterminate you, the crew, to ensure there is no rescue. You served me well in life. In death, you will serve me better. Goodbye, my subjects. Royal Edict playback complete. Initiating execution protocols. Stand down, droid. Your ruler sent me here. Internal Chrono estimates King Arak Drayan III has been deceased 106 years. Your statement is unlikely. I knew this conversation was going to end badly. Executing now. <laughs>
integrity failing. This vessel is entering the Singularity's event horizon. Vessel disintegration imminent. All crew advised to abandon ship. Hey, Captain. Bet you're surprised to see me. You realize you're a dead man, right? For a worthless piece of scum, you sure are an optimist. Me? I'm more practical. See, I've always believed if you can't beat him, join him. And then beat him. So, I stowed away back on Nar Shaddaa. Funny thing about Wookiees, they got great big lungs. It only takes a couple of breaths of happy gas to... Knock one out. I don't need Bodar to kill you. Skavik, I want my Blast Tech all 25 back. I want my Torchy. You have a real single-minded devotion to your toys, kid. It's gonna get you killed. I want to be civil about this. Sure, you've made my life miserable, but... I don't hold a grudge. Really. I've been wanting to kill you since Ord Mantell. Captain, I've been meaning to ask. Did you happen to... when you fought Skavik? Was Torchy there? That's a good gun. Two... Captain, did you... She's all yours, Corso. Use her in good health. Oh, <laughs> Dorothy! It's good to have you back, girl. I'm not letting another man touch you ever again. Thank you, Captain.
Welcome. Please select an available travel route. Zero S. Sugarzo. Ani adlok tak a fas emil kintik. I wasn't using it anyway. Besides, our captain has returned. You made it. Open this thing before it's too late. Give me the reliquary. I want to see these treasures before I die. I buried Skavik in that black hole, by the way. Long story. Who is this Skavik? He's nobody. I'll enter the code my father taught me. And... There. Such a simple act to fulfill a lifetime of effort. Congratulations, Captain. Nock Drain's lost fortune is yours. With one exception. Take the crown, Risha. Claim your birthright. Restore the Draean dynasty as rulers of Dubrillion. Wear the crown and rule that world. If anyone here is going to rule, it'll be me. For our bloodline. It's a key to power. For you, it's a hunk of metal. Remember those assassins on Tatooine? They were sent by the current King of Debrillion to end me. This king isn't gonna roll over just because you have the crown. The crown of Debrillion command- Will they be enough, Father? Can I really do this? If you're going to rule a world, Risha, you'll have to do questionable things. This is my final lesson to you. In the grand scheme of things, one spacer is meaningless. Keep the reliquary and its wealth. Kill him. Try anything, and you're all dead. Shut up, you fool. Father, no. The captain is a good man. I care about him. You... useless child. 
spent too many years without my guidance. You're weak, powerless. Everything I've done, the blood I've spilled, for nothing. <clears throat> this is not how it's supposed to end. <clears throat> Dispose of my father's body as he instructed Dr. Chela. You are released from my family's service. I'm sorry you had to see that, Captain. My father was sick. I appreciate you not trying to kill me. After all you've done, that would have been highly ungrateful. You're a wealthy man, Captain. That reliquary holds more than just family heirlooms. Merchants will be killing each other to buy what you're selling. Not sure what I'm supposed to do now. Everyone I've met from Dubrillion has tried to kill me. I don't have an army or a star fleet. I'm supposed to take over a whole planet with just a crown. Want a job fixing my ship while you work out the details? Your engines probably need a good tuning after that last trip. I'll take the job. Figures you'd be sticking around, Risha. You're like a mine out that way. I'll make sure all the right people hear what you did today, Captain. It's the least I can do. Besides, famous starship captains attract profitable opportunities. And queens in training can never have too many credits. Let's hit the hyperlanes. Master, I've marked the best escape pod for your sole use. I, of course, will go down with the ship. Looks like we've got a call coming in, Captain. Let me put it through. Captain, I heard about your fantastic success with Noctrain. I always thought his fortune was a myth. Who are you? And don't start trying to tell me I owe you money. Darlis Palmer, from Coruscant. I can't believe you've forgotten. I helped you find that wretched Skavik after he stole your ship. Vidu's friend, Captain, and mine, remember? Without him, we'd still be searching Coruscant street by street. I have a business proposition for you, but I'd rather discuss it face to face. Come to Port Nowhere, Captain. Floating Cantina, not far from you. I'll send the specs. <laughs> Seems like a safe location, Captain. But we need to be careful. The Imperials are getting more gutsy. There's nowhere in Republic space that's safe anymore. If you wanted safe, you picked the wrong man, sweetheart. If I wanted safe, nice, presentable at social functions, not held in smoke-filled cantinas. Hey, I like smoke-filled cantinas. I'm serious. I caught a signature when we were on Nar Shaddaa that looked like the Void Wolf. Someone I should know about? The man's a monster. Grand Admiral Haradax Kirill. Former slaver. Scourge of the Outer Rim and all-round charmer. 
My father always kept a close eye on him. The Void Wolf's got delusions of taking over the Underworld, handing it to the Empire wrapped in ribbon. Mm. <clears throat> then let's hit Port Nowhere fast and see if we can get out of his way. Is that what you owe me? I got no hold on you.